Thanks for rising around in Vampire Survivors Castlevania DLC. New DLC, new character, new stage. We've got Sonia Belmont herself, the legend that was retconned out. You gain the temporary cooldown reduction when overhealing by plus eight and can find special pickups for 4,750. I did not unlock the evolution for the whip or the water dragon whip because, uh, well, I had a choice. It's gonna be too hard to get it right, right? Right, what? A slash, maybe? Yeah, slash. Mount. What else buffs you up? Just slash and a mount, huh? Well, most of the whips are in here and slash, so. A fine enough pickup. Back, please. Oh, wow, that's funky. Now the trailer showed off what it did, but man, it's really weird to play with. Got to kind of take the damage to get it. Curve knife. That's on the map, so I don't need to bother with it. Water dragon went good. That'll give me some assistant clearance. Oh, what, what was that purple plus seven? Brown stone mask. Stone mask for... The knife, I think that might evolve it. Man, it's really good when it fires off. Try and find Whip of Alchemy too. Whipping, whipping good. It's damage up. Okay, so you can't flip it around. It fires off in one direction, which is makes it very funky to deal with. Spinach. Yeah, spinach is good. I want to get green mask with a knife attempt. Bit harder to use than some of the other ones up so far. One more. Empty tome, of course, is going to be great. Area. Ooh, good alchemy weapon. That'll give me some serious safety. And if I can just get the regular whip in the Vento Sacro, it should be super good. Here, Jisoo. Not picking that up for quite a bit. Duplicator. That's a good one. Maybe dupe. No, I had Duplicator with a knife. Didn't evolve. Hey, floor chicken. Woo. Get my weapons up. Need Vento Sacro now. Hey, heart refresh. This, I checked it in the collection later and it gives you a temporary five recovery. You can see right there, 5.5. Save the floor chicken for then. So I guess not bad on Cosmo either. 90 healing. More projectile. So that makes it last longer maybe. Spellbinder for it. Oh, and a tract orb. Just in case. All right, I was thinking a tract orb might do for water dragon whip because Santa water. Base area up. Ooh. Yeah. Nice on the base area. I was wondering if Gemini did it. All right, empty tome, a tract orb. What we're looking for. Perhaps could have held off on that. Wait, I'm right here. I should go fight the bat while I'm here. That's a good idea. Fight the bosses ASAP. And hopefully not have the game go oh, very spastic. The Whip of Alchemy gets stronger the more enemies you kill, or more bosses you kill. Which explains why I was doing so much. This is a fun whip. Giant bat! Oh man, that does so much damage. And Labrador. Area is two. Okay, so a tract orb and then empty tome to finish me off. Woo, take that bat. Hey, nice vacuum. Alright, one more check for everything's better. Oh wait, greed mask. Well, there's an armadillo right over there. I can go grab. 
after. Oh, right, I need Hollow Heart as well. For whipping. Da -da -da. Or I don't. Let's go double whip. Okay, what do I think? Skip the Empty Tome. That sounds very dangerous. There's in the second arm of Dio. I think getting this earlier is the better idea. That way I can get Bloody Tear and Walla Walla it. I'm really going for a long play here. Not Empty Tome. Empty Tome is for the star. Your Jisoo is for that whip. Cracked Orb might be for the Water Dragon whip. Green Mask. Man, I can't believe I'm getting... Well, Stone Mask. I just call it Green Mask because greed. Alright. Duplicator makes some sense. In Arbador too. And does it need to be fully kitted out? Put on the level ups. Alright. Got five things to test it with. And it's not working. Alright, then whatever. If attract orb and greed mask first. Stone mask, stone mask first. And then use the armadillo for the other one. What's that? Blue damage. Does the Sonic Whip do. This is Sonic Whip, right? I think it's called Sonic Whip. Another vacuum good. And vacuums from the maids. Hey yo. Tarjan Tarjan. Oh right, I wanted to get Blair all that. Damn that. That would have just fit so much for these issues. Oh, claw. Whoops. Water dragon whips up too. Wait, why did I get a did I get a rapid fire? How did I get a rapid fire? Oh no, wait, it's the overhealing thing. Okay. Oh wait. That's... Can I not go there? I can just go on the roof uh, up top in the library. Huh. I mean, it looks like I could. In Obrador. <laughs> Not getting a lot of actual whips uh, being picked up, huh? Uh oh. These guys and Medusa's here. Let's actually, give own mask first it is. He goes right here, and then I can track orb oh, immediately. Sorry, empty tome. You're amazing, but. I am not needing you right now. Okay. No evolution there. Now I can start grabbing my pickups. Let's see. Entosacro. And something else. Uh, Santa water. Wait, I can get that heart refresh. That'll heal and I'll trigger the rapid fire effect. Three hundred and ninety, that's a full heal. Heart refresh, pum roll, okay, yeah, that makes sense if you think about it. Man, I could be full whipping off this well all the time. Hmm. Be not gonna be empty tome. Wouldn't it be hollow heart? That'd be weird. Let's get the tear jisoo now since I'm full up. Go after the boss. What to do? Also, what's this area down here? It looks like there's something there. It looks like some just some mausoleums, tiny mausoleums.
bad merman. Oh, wind whip wings. That would make sense. You should be no trouble at all. Oh, unless you get somehow get pulled in with the whip. Gotta remember, get the bolero. Yeah, you got toasted. Alright, do I wait for something to max out passive-wise? Oh, uh, let's take the risk with the whip. Yeah, there it is. Must be a tract orb. Or, I guess, green mask. Uh, evolved dragon water whip? No, it's down there. And I have no idea what this is. Like. Great. Alchemy whip. So many whips. Whips like you wouldn't believe. Let's damage up by 10 again. Wait, the, go the goblins and the eyeballs count as bot. Wait. Well, I suppose that's the water dragon whip right there. Hydro storm. Amazing. 500 damage. The whip of alchemy hits so bloody hard. Like, man, that's crazy hard. So, Ento Sacro. I don't know what the blue numbers still are. It's weird that they show up. Wait, what am I doing? I need to progress. I'm not gonna... Brown will be faster, better. Longer, I'm not cut. Heads, heads, soul eater. Or soul steel. Open again. I don't think I unlocked another one. Deep in is this. Okay, yeah. This is good. Do I want to risk the silver ring? Or... I know it's better to upgrade regular whip. I want to do vampire killing. How close? Oh, right, the parge thing, too. I need to grab that. Wait, did I unlock the next one, too? Or was it just this one I'm next to? Oh, you're over here. Huh? I guess I need to stand on it for a bit. Man, the two whips do a ton of damage. None of those are... Wow, they ripped it apart. Oh, dang it, I should have held off on that. Go oh, seeing the vampire killer up. Especially would have with this vacuum. Heads. I don't think I failed that yet. Uh, track warp max it out. That way I level up faster. I mean, the next boss will be coming in pretty quick. Could probably just grab two other. Or Weapons. Alright, I need to grab those mirrors too. One of the characters unlocks with them. Get that big ol' over here, though. Charge! Charge with that cooldown reduction. Okay, actually, I could zoom out the map. Okay, yeah, there was another gate, and I just forgot to grab it. Like a shortcut ladder? No. I think I just have to run the whole way. Huge. Okay, Santa Water's good, and then Vento Sacro. You stood no chance. This damn is crazy good. Vampire Killer. Uh, just. One, yes, yeah, one's fake. 
Like, hope I get Vento Sacro. Hydro Storm! We win. Clear them all out. Whip them good. I mean, one weapon isn't going to make a difference. I've already won. <laughs> man, a lot of flea man riders here. And the harpies, too. He's pretty bad. Come on, just give me the Vento Sacro. Not what I needed. Vento Sacro, Vento Sacro. Hydro Storm doesn't do a lot. Wow. But it's Hydro Storm. It's literally the one you use to cheese death at the start. Arcana should be showing up, so I can get Belair off that. Huh? Whoa. Man, just sometimes you get that damage out of nowhere and you don't know where it comes from. Woo. We whipping good. It's some Bolero action. Keep in. But I don't pop all my rerolls. Oh, it counts as a boss. It gets sunburst. It means with Bolero, oh my god, it's gonna do so much damage. The sunbeam is only supposed to hit boss. Hold out till I max out the whip. Seven. Long now. Not long now. Yeah, the eyeball counts too. Crazy. Once I get bloody tear, tear through him. Alright, now everything on the Vento Sacro. That healing going. Come on, whatever I need. I'm going to be fighting up here for a while to make sure I maximize my power. Yeah. Hmm, last Arcana. Beginning or Slash? Her stone mask, just get out of the pool, I guess. No, Sarabande or beginning. I have options, many options. And I need to go back to get the shield, too. I think the description for this disc is here said it's like a defensive item. Gotta get out of the pool, Stone Mask. Wait. Stone Mask. Rock Bite. Would that evolve it? I suppose I'll find out soon enough. Good grief, it just does not want to give me the Vento Sacro. Damn, it is real nice now, though. There we go. You showing up yet? I don't have enough for ultimate whipin. I can try. Alright, here's my Fawala Fawalu chest. Oh, let's see. What other, like, cross or knife? Anything else that's Castlevania. Yes, Fawala Fawalu. Whipping it good. What? Oh, wait. Do I already have Vampire Killer? What am I talking about? I very obviously do. Lasers are not vampire er, Castlevania -y. kind of Osoma. Come on, axe, knife, cross. Heck, cross, expect no not cross. Axe, axe, I want axe. Axe is good. Well, I could Clover into, or I could Bolero chest into Clover, but that's unlikely.
Good grief. Well, lightning ring would have been fine. Huh? What was that? That was like a boss hit. Oh, it's you. Huh. Okay. I'm beginning here. I can Cerebonde to constantly get that overhealing procced. Ooh. It's a good idea. I mean, this only affects the one weapon. And it pays off. 16 health, that'll be procking it ultimately. No, I do not want any of these. Damn, I'm getting so many levels, that's so nice. Bit of a rocky start because of how the whip works, but once she gets going, that's a good passive. Especially for Fwalf Fwalf healing. Always get that cooldown going. And the whip is murderously strong. Oh, I can get Slabora. Seriously, no axe or knife. I prefer axe, but I'll take basically anything. Maybe I'll just grab a lightning ring. It shows up again. I can't just thunder loop it. It's kind of Castlevania. -y. I mean the for gun lightning gun alley card has Symphony of the Night, whatever it is. Then edge. Then edge. Then edge. Really. Good grief. They're all very, very high chance to show up too. And yet it just doesn't want to. 76 health. No, nothing particularly amazing there. Yerum. I ain't been up here for so long. Knife, I'll take knife. Not the best idea, but I'll take it. Alright, Discus, what do you got for me? Oh man, I moved so far away. Fire is a defensive projectile. Yeah, that has to evolve with that shield. Nice damage up. That's not really defensive. It's kind of pretty offensive. What's the fastest way to get over to it? Going down... Oh man, it's like right in the middle. Uh, I think the Telvor would still be faster. I'm trying to foot slog it. I could fight. Uh, what you would call it, dude? Uh, the doppelganger. Oh, still. I'm past with my tread and all that. There you go. Can't evolve. Heads. I called heads. I win. Ooh. Extra arcana. Now I can get beginning. Right? Oh, it has a chance to freeze. That's very nice. I didn't notice that last time. And if I get out of bounds, that's a constant full swing plan. Well, not that great, I guess. But hey. Yeah, this doesn't seem to... Hmm. Should have read the description. That doesn't seem to be doing any freezing. Even if my luck is... Well, actually pretty high. Or pretty normal. Loop around. No, it's definitely faster to teleport. Then I can teleport over to the other one. I don't think there's anything else along the way. You stood no chance. Hey, Clover.
So did I unlock the fourth one? Yeah, that's the fourth one. Oh right, I can grab the shuriken here too. It goes up with an empty tome, which I don't have, but I already unlocked it, so it not much matter. Oh yeah, and the mirror, the mirror. It, like, fires off all the weapons and then does something else. It gives you a mount, it gives you a mount. So, there's six amount when I should only have three. Base damage up. Wait, I could go take you down. It'll be slow going, but I can do it. Do, 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 do. Whipping good. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be freezing with the Hydro Storm effect. I guess it might just be direct hits from the whip. Yeah, this is a lot of stuff on the map. The power of sun compels you. Wow, you survived a lot, considering. Oh, discus. Hey, see you up again. Pull down and down again. You stand no chance. You need to actually make sure I hit you with some of these whips. Labora. Yay, I get a book. The magic of whip. Yeah, and of course. Oh, well, let's get lucky. Discus. Nope. Yeah, it's gotta be the shield. It wouldn't make sense to be... Well, maybe armor, maybe armor, but I doubt it. Oh, that's a trick. Uh, let's see, there's the ice book with the uh, other guy, the one that sort of looks like a plague doctor. I took out this guy down here already. So I don't need to go there. The skull is missing. 19 minutes in, I'm very strong. Okay, this is closer. Two bosses in the way, or one? Oh, hurry go. Oh, right. The knife down here. Phew. I almost forgot about it. This is the one that might evolve off the stone mask if the rock bite doesn't. Rocket bite, stone mask. That just kind of makes sense now that I think about it. Or rock riot. I huh. wonder if there's a way to... Uh... Okay. I know some of these require it maxed out, but it's not saying it, I think, there. I just wanted to check to see. Rock and riot. Here we go. Up through the pick portrait gallery. Oh, take him out nice and good and plenty. Need to get some more mirrors too to unlock another character. Next chest will get me the good stuff. You will die instantly. Well, not super instantly, but still pretty close. Ooh, three treasure chests in a row. Yep, that totally evolved it with stone mask in it. Gamma Troper. Evolved rock right. Also triggers a pain of crystals. X is tiny. No, get the Parma. Do one chest with it, then get the other one. With max out. Shield. This way? Yeah, it has to be. No other way to go. Man, these halls are looping. It's like a castle of the creature of chaos or something. Let's go, let's go. He's surviving some vamps. Arm Aegis. Still don't know what that effect does. It doesn't seem to increase the invincibility after you revive either. Death kills you just as fast. 
curved knife first. I have many knives. I have many things that are thrown. This is the only one that might. Like I'm thinking just, you know, Grant probably has it. So he, isn't, he isn't gonna have a regular knife. Let's see if it needs to be. Or it doesn't evolve with it. That seems unlikely. Power of light compels you. You need three more levels in it. It wouldn't be too hard to get. Uh, there's a boss over here. This one drop anything? Maybe just a chest boss. Uh, maybe could have gotten to push the clover out of rotation. Oh, over here. Oh, slaughtering Gaiba. Uh, someone has to beat you to unlock a character. Not sure if it's Sonia. Wow, you're very healthy. Two chests for you. I got three chests now, so that's quite a bit. That's the Arcana chest. Giving me nothing. Valero, help me out. Good grief, just doing everything to not get the harm I just, huh? Oh, so nice to clear through things so easily. I called heads. Oh, it drops coffins now. Oh. Or no, they're crystals. That would make more sense. It's like it's a clear debris that doesn't suck. Dual boss, dual death. Get the, this one first. Oh, sweet. Empty tome. Thanks for making me more powerful. <laughs> what? Oh, there was like a little thing there. Yeah, where are those? They're like weird sherbet. Oh, they're gems. Oh, the tear toppers doing that. They're gems. Like they might give money or more XP. The text was very small. Okay, this has to evolve it. Yeah. This is Stellar Blade. Evolved discus. Travels along walls. Deals critical damage if the user is invulnerable. What? Oh, it's a better diver mines too. So that means how invulnerable are we talking about? Like what there are multiple types of invulnerability, like there's apparently invulnerability after being hit. I don't think actually exists. And vulnerability after healing from food pickups. And there's another Arcana Goblin, that's Excellent for me. Gotta get that chest. <laughs> Actually, because full of Fawalu and Magnet, these are gonna be amazing together. All right, no chests. Go over to Goat Zone. I don't think I need to beat. Doppelganger with Sonia. I think that's just Trevor to unlock the other card. Which is weird, because Sonia had a kid with Alucard in the cannon with she. Should be able to get up pretty quickly. Crazy death beams here. Nothing's gonna break through this. Hey, some coffins. Right, this is fake. Get the mirror. Okay, no, Trevor's speed broke through there. That is not an area you're supposed to go down. Oh, wow, the lock. Gemini? Well, let's see what Gemini pulls off. Yeah, it just fires out two of them. Oh, wait. 
it's not going to be 118 weapons. It's going to be... Good God, what? Not going to be 118 because there's a lot of Gemini weapons in there. Okay, I mean, it kind of is, but it also kind of isn't. Also, oh my God, it's huge. You're going to go full spell build. Full spell book build. Wait, you drop a spell book. I gotta go get you. It's probably gonna be a tractor warp because it's ice. Right? Uh, what else could it be? Anything that would be all that different? Uh, waste a lot of time on this. I mean, I didn't have a tractor warp when I got it on the last one with Trevor. Belmonto. You will not last any time at all. You can't even move towards me. Oh, three bosses in a row. There looks to be something inside you. I have no idea what. Shuriken's max, so that means I get Yago Shuriken in. Hey, Toronas Box, welcome. I mean, I doubt it'll be Corona's box maxed out, but I'm fine with maxing it out to get my good stuff going. I'm not even healing because Fawal Fawal can't hit anything. Everything dies too quickly. Oh. The whole reason I went over there was to get the book and I don't grab it. Go figure. I mean, empty tone would make sense. I mean, there's so many weapons, like, you're gonna have double ups just by default. Unless they're combos. And it's damaging ice projectiles in an area. And that gets Gemini too. I hope it's wings. Corners box, I want more enemies. They're not gonna survive, even if more of them show up. So that means more XP, which means more levels, which means more good stuff. Rail and ice. 113. Pretty good level. Oh. That's not the evolved ice fang. Alright, enemies. Give me what you got. Ooh, I'm hitting big numbers here. In hundreds. Heavy four digit damage. First isn't going to save you gonna save me. I'm a vampire survivor after all. The OG. Look at that Bram Stroker. Your Van Hell sings. Who needs you when you got a Belmont? I don't even know where the boss is. Some finger sword guy? Or Edward Scissor's hands? He's dead already. Drops a book. Gale Forest fires light hitting projectiles backwards. So, wind or light? Damage up by 2, speed up by 50. Oh, yeah, same. Oh, I'm speed breaking. Tagly, alright. I'll let you grab that. Make things tougher. Boss, eyeball, eyeball. Armor. Man, what insane luck she's been having. I got Bel Air with the start of even crazier. Doesn't pull in the gems. I mean, armor wouldn't evolve either of those, that's for sure. Ooh, man, I need a lot of levels stored up, huh? Pew, pew, pew. How long are you going to last, Atlantean? You can barely move. You're getting hit by so much nonsense. I got two full rows of weapons. Not much is breaking through that. And none of this is still evolving the Sonic, but it has to be a ring then. Oh, I have to go up. I don't know if anything's even here. It's so hard to tell. I think that's the boss on the right there. Hey, 
Final one, King's Gate. Allows Neutron Bomb to materialize and grants access to new power directly to this castle. Yeah. More armor. 28. Oh, allows me to go up there and grab a Neutron Bomb. More armor. Gate. So I can just skip right here to grab the bomb. What's here to the left? That's so much weapon, isn't it? Starting weapon? That or a grenade. Luck. Get luck, so that might be my next Bolero. I mean, I have a... I'm not picking this up. Okay. Ah, who needed to see what's on the screen? That's overrated. Armor just in case, then the tag it. Oh wait, maybe Neutron Bomb is just a regular pickup item. And not something on the map, because... Yeah, it was blinking like one. Over here. Oh, there's something that's durable. There, chest? Chest drop? What? The heck was that? What's going on? I'm not moving like that. Oh, oh, it's a 2D section. I just can't tell. Yeah, flipping. Okay, I got confused because, well, look at what's happening on screen. Oh, is this the th Dracula's throne room? I think that's the throne room. So what's the thing on the left? Okay, back to a normal plane. Great A nonsense going on right here. That's what the vampire survivors you know and love. I can get another... Oh, wait, there was a chest up there that I missed. Well, I have the speed to make it. Yeah, yeah, this is Dracula's throne room from Cynthia Knight. This is a teleporter. So, yep, and, oh my god, is there going to be an inverse castle? Like, holy crap, if so. Oh, this doesn't matter at this point. What am I talking about? Rio. want to get the chest from whatever spawns in. Try and get the evolution sorted out. There's something here. This is a boss. Wait, no. These are Gaibans, aren't they? Or slogans. Gaibans? One of them. Oh, please have one more revive. Dang it. All the Dragon Warp. Unlocked Grant the Nasty. Oh, yeah. Unlocked Charlotte. King's Gate, Neutron Bombs, New Teleporter, unlocks the Sonic Whip, I didn't evolve it, get the discs to level 5 to unlock it, and evolve the Rock Riot to unlock it. Get all our stuff to go. Oh, wait, why is it let me scroll down? Oh, it's because I actually can scroll down because I got enough stuff. Oh, huh, why is it in gray? Wondering the Jet Black did the most, at 57 million, 141k. That was without anything increasingly excessive. Uh, let's see, other whips. Empire Killer, 18 point mil. Hydro Stormer Tip, 22.7. Wall of Waller did nothing. Gamma Torpor did a ton too. Got stuck behind Wandering the Jet Black being nonsense. Like the old... Huh. A stellar Blade, probably could have done better. Shuriken didn't do much. Oh, it's the, it's the Gemini ones down there, Speculo. Okay, that's the successful Sonya rundown, and she even got a golden egg. Alright, that was fun. Next up is going to be Christopher. Well, no, it's not. It's going to be Alucard, because I need to get the Alucard Sorb evolved. 
involve the jet black whip, that's probably Christopher's, right? Well, next up, it's time for a vampire to actually show up in Vampire Survivors. Okay, and that's another section of the Beswick Down. 1,900 it with Sonia Belmont complete. OG, the original progenitor of the line before Leon. Eight. 88. That's 154 more to go. Next up's going to be Alucard himself, the son of Dracula, our first vampire in Vampire Survivors. Oh no, how could that have happened? Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Please like, dislike, comment, subscribe if you haven't, and thank you anyone who has. Either way, have a good day and keep messing around in the Vampire Survivors Beswick.